Talafalaba. Um, kia ora. My name is uh, Henry Taifu. I'm uh, an ambassador for Digital Discipline and uh, I play professional rugby. Since um, taking on this role as, uh, as an ambassador for Digital Discipline, you know, I've been really um, just conscious, uh, I feel, of, of you know, my um, well, social media um, in general, but just, I guess, my, how I want to spend my time and um, you know, how I want to give, what, what I give my attention to. So, uh, you know, in the past I'd easily just you know, scroll, through, scroll through social media and, um, you know, just watching, watching you know, stories, endless stories and, uh, you know, and, and that was normal. But I, I guess um, being a, an ambassador sort of made me rethink some of that and you know, that it, some of the habits that we do, do on a daily basis. You know, all it takes is an hour, um, you know, a day and then that time could, could add up and you know, instead of being really intentional, being um, you know, useful of your time, you know, an hour can maybe add it to and then before you know it, you know, you've spent your whole day just watching you know, endless um, stuff on, on social media or you know, even, even on TV. But just since taking on this role, you know, I do realize that, um, that there are addictions that you know, aren't sort of visible. There's addictions that you, know, um, that you can't really see. And, and you know, since since being part of part of this team, I, I feel like you know, um, I'm more aware, aware and more conscious of just just some of the behaviors and, and that. In terms of social media addiction, um, you know, the work that um, Digital Discipline is doing, you know, I feel like there's no um, company or no um, you know rehab that can help you with that. And um, it hasn't really been until um, you know, got in touch with Tony and you know, seeing the work that they do that I sort of I'm like, wow. You know, I feel like in our society, technology is such a big, big, um, I guess, issue, and um, I feel like social media is, is one, one of the things that contributes heavily to that. Being a, like, a professional athlete, um, people sort of only get a glimpse of you know, 80 minutes of, of a game, and you know that's all they, they really see. So you know, if you're playing really well, then you know they'll support you, and if you play badly, sometimes you know. The, you might you might get caught in you know especially after you lose a game you know seeing some of the comments after the game and, and, and them sort of saying negative things and I feel like you know people only see 80 minutes of, of, of a game and and not the hours and hours of work that you put in during a week and, uh, and you know I feel like social media um, these days a lot of people have access to you that probably hasn't been there in the past and you know I see my, my family you know I try and make a conscious effort to you know put my phone down um, put my put my gear away and then um, I can be fully present with my family and my, and my kids and you know from uh, you know from nine from nine o'clock to, to 6 30 in the morning my phone is on you know um, my screen time is off so you know I, I don't get it as distracted so you know I feel like um, you know, the work that digital discipline is doing, you know, it can help anyone. And uh, being present, um, being in the moment, being in the now, um, obviously, you know, it's something that I try and um, just be really conscious about. As a father, it's the same thing. So, you know, no matter what sort of distractions you've had or how bad your day has been at work or whatever, you, whatever you do, um, you know, seeing your kids, seeing my kids is, is, is the is the best part of my day and then come running up to me so if I'm not fully present or if I'm still you know thinking about you know that time at, at, at work or at training where you know I knocked on that ball or I man I should have done this or I should have done that you know and then that sort of takes away um, that time with your kids and, and that, that moment so um, you know, being fully present and being in the moment enjoying the moment you know I think that's a it's a skill um, something that's really um, yeah, I've tried really hard to work on and um, you know with obviously social media and technology um, you know if you're you know the, if you have if you have a work phone or you know if your work computer and, and you take that home you know you don't really fully get away from that you don't really fully escape sort of work so you know being fully present uh, with your kids you know they don't really care um, you know if you've had a bad day or you know they really care 
what you've done, as long as you know you're fully there and you know you, you're fully um, giving them that time and, and, and being in the moment. So um, I feel like there's a lot of distractions in this world, and uh, you know social media is a big one. So you know when that notification comes on and and then you know like your kids are there, it's easy to say, oh just just hold on, I, I got to take this call, or you know just hold on, I uh, I got to comment back. Um, but I feel like those are the moments that you know are probably the best moments as a as a as a father or as a as a husband is you know being there fully undivided attention giving that to your to your to your family or giving that to someone else you know I think that's the best gift that you can give and that you know there's also still a lot a lot of work to be done you know it's it's going to be a, um, something that's ongoing and I feel like its impact uh, you know is going to reach you know a lot of people um, and I feel like uh, yeah for me you know, there's one person and you know there's many people out there who, who go through the same sort of sort of thing.